students and parents of the class of 2020, the counselors are excited to announce that the sophomore registration process will soon begin. This is a tutorial on how to submit your course request for the 2017-2018 school year. Students will need to select a career academy, select a program of study, and select core classes, electives, and backup electives. A career academy is a small learning community that provides individualized education relevant to students' career interests. There are five career academies, Arts and Communications, Business Management and Information Systems, Health and Medicine, Human Services, and Science, Technology, Engineering, and Math. A program of study is a student's plan for success. This decision can be made upon students' interests or career goal. The programs of study break down your career interests even further. This helps students, parents, and counselors in choosing the appropriate classes for your career interest pathway. Please reference our District Academies page to learn more about our programs of study which can be located by going to www.jths.org. From there, place your cursor over Academies. Select JTHS Academies, find West Academies, and from there click on the various Academies and discover what they are all about. This is an example of a typical sophomore schedule. You will have six academic courses and a lunch and advisory. Please visit our website to access our course offerings guide, which will provide a course description for each class. The course offerings guide can be found at www.jths.org. Place your cursor over the District 204 tab. Click on Academics. Finally, click on the course offering guide and that will bring you to the course descriptions. When navigating through the course offerings guide to select electives, it will be important to look at two things. One, the student has met the prerequisites for the course, and two, the student is in the correct grade. For example, if a student wants to request Culinary Arts 1, they have to be in grades 10, 11, or 12, and have taken and passed Food Fundamentals 1. JTHS Blended Learning Opportunities challenge and empower students to become active learners through both face-to-face -face and online instruction. This format allows students more flexibility and control over when they choose to learn. In addition, the blended learning structure exposes students to the online learning environments that they are likely to experience in college as well as the workplace. Sophomores may be eligible to take English 2 Honors, Health, and Food Fundamentals 1 and 2 in the blended learning format. To learn more about blended To learn more about blended learning, please visit www.jths.org. Place your cursor over the District 204 tab. Click on Academics. Once in Academics, click on the Blended Learning tab. This will direct you to the Blended Learning Information page. We hope that winter break is a time that parents and students can discuss their sophomore year classes together. Located on the Home Access Center is the Career Planner. The Career Planner is where students can input their courses that they would like to request for their sophomore year. Once logged on to the Home Access Center, you will click on the Classes tab located at the top of the page. From there, you will then click on Career Plan. Here is an example of a blank career plan. Click on one of the school years highlighted in yellow to enter course requests. Once you enter a school year, you will be given a list of subjects. Click on the edit button across from the subject area you wish to work on. For example, select the edit button across from English. Within each subject area will be an extensive list of classes. Locate the class you want to request and check the request box. Then press Save. It is very important to click the Save button. Once all subject areas are complete and saved, the course request will be able to be viewed by the school counselor. 
We will meet with each individual student to discuss the course requests and determine if that is the appropriate schedule. If there are any questions, students should bring those to school in January to discuss with the counselor. If you are interested in honors, please tell your counselor during registration. There will be an application process. Students that plan on participating in marching band may be eligible for a PE waiver. Athletic performance is a PE class for students that participate on a Joliet West sports team. Please remember the courses selected by students are requests. The final schedule will be completed with counselors in January and February. Semester exam grades should be posted by December 22nd. Please check the Home Access Center under Grades and then click on Transcript. The grades will be listed under Semester 1. Remember, A's, B's, C's, and D's are passing. If a student has earned an F, they will not receive credit. Finals can be a very stressful time for students. I am very proud of all of our freshmen. They have made it through their first semester. We hope students and their families have a wonderful holiday season, and we look forward to another great semester starting on January 9th, 2017.